Hey guys, it's me Melissa and welcome back to my channel. Today we got a Wish clothing haul. It has been quite some time since we have done a Wish clothing haul and I'm so excited to do one. Now because I won that Wish cash, I did spend a little bit more money on this round of clothing and I think some of the next round of clothing, but then I went back to my like clickbait ways because I'm wondering if I spend a little bit more money getting the exact size I want and the exact color I want, does it make the quality any better? Probably not. But we'll see. And there's a couple items in here. Two of these items. One I've wanted for so long and I just couldn't get myself to spend the money. And then one I kept seeing on limited quantity deals and it is silly and I'm going to save it for last. But like I just had to have it. Does that make any sense? Also if you're new to Wish or have not shopped on Wish in the last 30 days, you can use the code down in the description box to save you up to 80% off and that's up to $25 off your order. Best code out there. Now we have eight clothing items Then we also got, I got my final mask in. Those masks are so much fun. This one I paid $3 for. I know I said in the video that it was another sequins mask. That's what I thought it was going to be. And when it showed up, there's any sequins. <laughs> Look at this. This is blinging, but completely see-through. Now this would be something I could possibly put over my disposable one to give me like a little bling because I mean literally see-through. <sighs> yeah, completely breathable. But I mean, who has a blinging one? Have you seen a person yet with a blinging mask? I mean, that's fancy. I wonder if I like went to work and put it over my um, disposable mask and people would be like, what is that? What are you wearing? I might try that out. I might bring it to work, put it on over my disposal mask, see if it like covers up the same, and then see if I can still breathe okay and see what people think. Also, these are how they tie the side. A little weird, because once you pull this thing off, it's going to come apart. But it's just me just fine the way it is, so. Who would have thought? <laughs> Bling. Blingy mask. Okay, so I really can't remember entirely, because I think I got these all in right when I got the, I think this is like the first order I did when I won that Wish Cash, which I hope they keep doing these contests because hopefully you guys win some Wish Cash too. I'm just going to open them all up and then I'll try them on kind of in a way that is easiest for me. So this is, I got an extra large. It's $10.81. It says extra large. So boom, extra large. Like I said, after this haul, and I think one more clothing haul, whenever that stuff comes in, there'll be um, more back to clickbait. Oh, so these shorts, I really want some more shorts. And so I read the description, and I, and I read what the review said, and one girl said to order two sizes up. One girl said to, she had a picture, she said order two sizes up for sure, and they look perfect on her. And another one said one size. So I went for the two size because I'd rather... I don't know, I'd rather be too loose than be too tight. But these are them. No pockets in the back. But we'll see. I mean, do I think they're worth $10? I mean, if they fit, $10 for a pair of shorts isn't, isn't bad. What's next? So this I got in medium, and it's $8.69. This is a funny one. There's another one I ordered that's funny about the whole situation going on in the world right now. But it's... Like, I found that any clothing that's coming from the Hong Kong Sorting Center... It's almost like it never comes. Like, check your orders and see if any of your clothing items are coming from the Hong Kong Sorting Center. And if you've got them, let me know because there's a whole order I did in April that came from there. None of them showed up. So this one, it looks like it'd be nicely big sized. And it says, stay at home, established 2020. I probably could have got a small in this. I mean, I say that all the time and then they fit. So we got that. Next, this one came in a, in a purple bag. Um, so I got this in medium. And it was $16. Ooh. This is the one that I wanted forever. And even some of you guys have been like, have you seen this, Melissa? And I'm like, yeah, I've seen it, but I just can't get myself to spend the money on it. How do I open this? Oh, over here. It is the Chihuahua Pajama Set. What size did I get in? Medium? That's like it fits. So these are the little shorts. Look at that. <laughs> and here's a shirt. It's definitely, um, croppy, crop toppy. That's the shirt. And then, like, the tail goes onto the back. It is, like, spandexy type material, but for pajamas, I really don't care. 
Looks like it'll be very, very flowy. I've wanted that. Since I started buying clothing on Wish, I think that has been the thing that's been in my save cart. And I've just been like, one day, Melissa. Today's the day. So this one right here I got in large and it was $10.66. Now all these items I might have like taken out to see what they were. So I gotta write down what they were, but I haven't tried anything on. So you guys are seeing for the first time. So this is a large. Oh, here's another pair of shorts. Now that looks small. Maybe. So it's just kind of a pair of like lounge shorts, which I was gonna either use for just like running to the store or um to sleep in. They look a little tight. We'll have to see. They look a little tight. What's next? So this, um, I got in a medium and it was $13. I'm hoping this is cotton. Seems like cotton to me. So it's a dress with a skull on it. But it has these like, like rips or whatever over here. This one's pretty big. What size is this? Medium? It was pretty big. We'll see. And then, I'm sorry if you don't like the way I do it this way instead of like put on try, put on try. I used to do that a long time ago, but it's just a lot. It's a lot to sit there and just do clip after clip. And it's easier for me to do it this way than to try to clip where I put it in and move it. And I'm not an editing master. So this I got in a medium, it was $13. I've also seen this a bunch. Is this it? Yeah. So this is the shirt that you supposedly can like put your animal in. So like it's a shirt and you can just carry your animal around in. I have no clue what Papa's going to think about this. <laughs> He'd probably be like, get me out of here. But I wanted it. And so next one I got in a large and it was $12. Says large right here. I know some people say they get like annoyed with the crinkling, but it is what it is. <laughs> so here these are. These look like they'll be okay. And also I got these for like pajama pants, and they're just camo, and they're flat. They're like straight at the bottom. They're not like like tight at the bottom. They feel very soft. Definitely like cotton. And they have pockets. Yes. Now we got one more item. Okay. Let's try on all these, and then I'll show you this. All right, so let's try these on. Okay, so here are the first pair of shorts, the ones I ordered two sizes up. They're pretty big. Like, if they're, if they're possibly they're supposed to be worn up here, they're, like, ginormous. I like to wear my shorts a little bit lower, but they still are pretty darn big. Very, like, flowy. I really think that I could have got, um, I could have got a large for sure. I maybe could have gotten a medium in them also, but definitely a large. They do have nice pockets, two buttons, and a zipper. I kind of wish they had pockets in the back. They almost they almost have the feeling of you know the shorts that you wear over your bathing suit where you can go swimming in. They almost feel like that. I mean, I'll definitely wear them. I don't know if I'll wear them like out the places. You know, like look how it gives you that like whatever right here because it's so baggy. This could be something I wear over a bathing suit. It's very very light and very very like um cool cooling. Like even up here where it's really, really hot, I can barely even tell I have shorts on. So that's a bonus. But I really do wish that I would have gotten them in a large, if not a medium. All right, let's try on those other pairs of shorts. Okay, so these are the size large. And I'm guessing the way you want them to fit is have them kind of like high-waisted up here because otherwise the crotch kind of like sags down. They are very tight on my legs. And even, I mean, if I pull them down... They look kind of weird because they're supposed to be like tight. So it looks like I'm like, it looks like I'm sagging them. So I guess obviously they have to be up here. But they are pretty tight around here. I wonder if I like rip them a little bit. You know how you do that? Like you take a, and you kind of rip the thing a little bit and then they're much more comfortable. That might work if I rip it a little bit. But I think that I probably should have definitely got a extra large in these. <laughs> Maybe like a 2XL. Because even up here is pretty tight. Like I would never even use this. To tighten it anymore at all like i wish it was a little bit looser i don't know i'm not loving these for the price okay let's try on those camel pants okay so here are the size large 
pajama pants. I was using them for, I mean, they don't have to be pajama pants, but I want them for pajama pants. They are a little bit long on me, but that is okay. I can just pull them straight up and they just kind of sit there, but they're very comfy, like super duper comfy. The large still has like room. I doubt I'll use these, or if I do, I'll just tighten it up just to be where it is right now. I like my pajama bottoms to be loose, but these are so soft, like so soft, so comfy. I don't know. I find that like I've gotten so many good pajamas from Wish. Like that's probably one of the items that I wear all the time is my pajamas from Wish. And these will definitely be something I'm going to wear all the time. Like all the time. I mean, right now it's hot, but like when I go to bed at night, I don't mind having like pants on. We got the fan going, the AC in that room. But yeah. Yes, I love these. Okay, what's next? I guess we'll do, maybe we'll do the Chihuahua set and then the dress. I mean, come on. <laughs> these are the cutest pajamas I've ever had on in my entire life. Yeah, my entire life. This medium fits good. Could I have gotten a large and it maybe been a little bit looser and been fine? Yes, but oh my gosh. Now the shorts are a little bit shorter. They don't kind of pass my test. I could bring them down a little bit and that'll be like, okay, it is a crop top. So I guess I don't care if I'm wearing this like around the house, like just me and Rob. I don't care about having a crop top on. I wouldn't wear this obviously in public. I'm not a crop top girl anymore. But look at how cute. It is that spandex material, but very, very soft and very, very comfy. I love this. The only thing that can take this up a notch is if these shorts have some pockets in them. I'm so glad I finally own the Chihuahua pajama set. I think they actually make this pajama set in other dog breeds also, but a Chihuahua one always seems to pop up for me because I always search things that are like Chihuahua. So yeah, I almost do wish I got a large. I almost do wish, but that's okay. I'm still gonna wear them. I'll even try to do like the trick where I like, like try to loosen it up a little bit. But yeah, so excited about this one. All right, let's try that dress on now. Okay, so here's this dress. Probably could have got a small, but I really don't want it to be skin tight. It might've been supposed to be, I don't know, you'll see it over here. It's supposed to have been skin tight in the model. I don't love it. I don't love it. I mean, it's that normal like cotton material from Wish, but like how the edges are never like finished. They're just kind of like stop. So they're kind of like, I don't know, um, rough a little bit on the edges. And they have all those little rips throughout. It's okay. I can, I'm probably gonna, not going to lie to you. I'm probably going to wear this as pajamas. I mean, it's just nothing where I'm like, oh my gosh, this is the most awesome dress I've ever seen in my life. I almost wish, I think if like the skull pattern, there was a pattern everywhere maybe along with it, that I might like it better, but it's kind of like boom skull and like gray everywhere. And you're like, you can see like the lines of my underwear because it's so thin. So it'll probably be pajamas, but that, nothing wrong with that. I like, I'm always into getting new pajamas. I like to cycle out pajamas. I wear pajamas so much, especially over that lockdown. I was like pretty much living in pajamas. So now I'll be able to kind of get some out, bring some in. Okay. Now we got shirts. Let's try on. And here's this one. Definitely a little bigger. This is a medium. And I think that I, I think even the clickbait one on this was a small. And then it never processed. So I ordered bo both. I ordered this in medium and then I ordered the clickbait one in like black in the small or extra small. And then it never processed. So I got a refund for it. But yeah, these do shrink a little bit when you wash and dry them. So I'm pretty sure it will. That will be something that I wear out. I kind of like my t-shirts to fit a certain way when I go out. This might look be better with a pair of jeans or maybe like even like tuck the front in a little bit like with a pair of jeans like that. But yeah, I mean funny. They have a lot of these things, like the other one, if it ever does come, it says a quarantini, which is just a martini at home <laughs> or something like that. But it was hilarious. And I was like, oh my God, I have to have it. And all the ones I got before were ones, a lot of them were about like the pandemic and like, um, Tiger King and all that stuff. But all those came from the Hong Kong Story Center and all of them not come. I got a refund for all of them, but still I wanted them. Maybe I'll run by them again and like buy it again. All right, let's try out the one with Paco. He was totally asleep. Like when I say totally asleep, he was like conked out. I went to go touch him and he, he jumped. I felt so bad. So, I mean, it works. Look at him. But like it pulls so much that, you know, it's pulling like where you see all my bra at the side. Was this a medium? It still fits good. It makes it almost like you're pregnant. Like you're expecting. I'm expecting a chihuahua. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. 
Especially like sometimes people come over, like a, a night somebody come do something on the house. And even though Paco is a great dog, I don't want him to be kind of like following him around or getting in his way. And sometimes it's like awkward to just hold him all the time. So, or I, like, and I hate putting him, like locking him in the closet, in the, not the closet, the bathroom so he doesn't get in the way. So this is the way. You can kind of have, I mean, if Paco was a teacup chihuahua, this thing would work so much better. Are you liking it in there? Huh? Do you like this? No? You want to go show them the piece de resistance? The really cool, cool one? Alright, let's do that. And then, when you're not carrying around your dog, it just looks like a cute little shirt. Like, you wouldn't even know, like, what it, what it was. Like, I could totally wear this out and nobody would have a clue. It's like a pocket that's made to hold an animal. Now I had a bunch of kittens. Put a little bunch of kittens in there. And, it, and like I said, it stretched out only because Paco was in it. Otherwise, it fits perfect. Like, actually, this is one of the comfiest shirts and the best quality because it has actually, like, a real end out of most of the shirts I've gotten off Wish. So I'm pleased with that. Now, the big one. This is going to get me so hot. I got this in a 4XL because that's what it said on the thing. The sizing said to get a 4XL. Now, whether this is ginormous, I haven't even taken it out of the thing. It could be, but I follow what it said, so I got a 4XL, $41. Now, if you tell me you haven't seen this before, I'm going to be like, really? Because even if you haven't seen it in your actual feed, maybe you've seen it on the limited quantity deals, because that's where I saw it all the time. I'm hoping it's not ginormous. It looks pretty big. It's the Nicolas Cage. <laughs> So what's that? <laughs> have you seen it? Like, have you? So this looks like it'll be pretty big. But I did, like I said, I followed exactly what it said on the description I went to order. I, even when I, I was ordering it, I was like, I was like, 4XL, that sounds ginormous. But this is Asian sizing, so who knows? Who knows? I mean, it has a tie at the front. They're probably going to be pretty long, too. The bottoms are kind of like a little bit thinner, uh, tighter. And it is kind of that spandexy, but not, if you know what I talk about. Like, it's stretchy, but it's thicker. So it's not like that spandex that's extremely thin that shows everything. It's a thicker type spandex. It's got a hoodie. I mean, that's what happens when you get some wish cash that was just given to you. In the beginning, you go a little crazy. Now I'm being more reasonable, but I did go a little crazy. So let's go try this on. And here it is in all of its glory. <laughs> it's big. But I did tighten it, and even though it's like huge, like it's pretty big everywhere, I mean, who cares about a loungy, funny outfit? Um, it's got pockets right here. If it was a little bit bigger, it probably would fit Rob. I couldn't imagine him wearing this anywhere. It's just like Nicolas Cage head all over you. I don't even love Nicolas Cage. I literally bought this because I saw it so many times and I lost on it probably 50 times on limited quantity deals that I was like, you are mine. And it's really comfy. It's even got the front thing here. I mean, there was a couple pictures, like I think it was a guy that was wearing it and I was like, oh my gosh, he looks hilarious in this. You could even wear this to Halloween if you wanted to. I mean, I'm sorry. A lot of you guys are going to be like, Melissa, have you lost your mind? Maybe. Maybe I have. Let's finish this video. Paco's like, what do you wear, Mom? <laughs> That's a little weird. It is very comfy, though. Not going to lie. And I'm not super duper warm in it, so it's not, not going to be something where you're going to be uh, like a lot of heat coming from it. Or you'll probably want to wear something underneath this if it's cold out. I'm happy I got it. So I think I feel like we got a lot of good items. Now, am I going to keep buying things that are a little more expensive? I don't know. Like, I want to try out like a bunch of clickbait ones to show you guys kind of what it could be if you order a clickbait item size-wise. But I feel like we only got like, I mean, these were a little tight. I probably can still wear them. These were a little loose. Maybe they'll shrink a little bit in the washer and dryer. I don't think so because of the, the, what they are, but everything else, 
I mean, even this. Now, would I have paid this much money for it? Not this. The dress. Regularly? No. For a pair of pajamas? No. But at least we got to see what it looks like, so you'll know. So, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments or any questions, please put them down below, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you haven't yet subscribed, I mean, Nicholas Cage wants you to. Ah. Hashtag road to 20K. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see you soon. Bye.